Overall, in the U.S., more than 20 million Americans suffer from osteoarthritis. Judith Dotton is in her early 40s and is already suffering. Usually I have pain mostly in my hips and my knees, and walking can be something else. I get a lot of numbness, tingling, and a lot of pain on the leg. Because of patients like Judith, the chondroitin glucosamine market in the United States is estimated to top $1 billion a year. But now, according to the latest research in the Annals of Internal Medicine, chondroitin provides either very little or no symptomatic improvement for patients suffering from osteoarthritis of the knee or hip. It was actually a study of 20 other studies which compared chondroitin to either placebo or no treatment. And if you looked at the, the downside, there was very little downside. So if it gave a placebo effect and it did help somebody, why not? Take it. No big deal. It's not going to hurt you. And if it helps you, whatever helps, as long as it's not detrimental to you, we'll do it. And many experts will agree that for now, if you're on it, you can keep taking it and get what appears to be that placebo effect. There were no side effects identified, but there was no additional benefit than you would get from a sugar pill or no treatment. And this expert says traditional medicine has been shown to be clearly better. There have been two recent studies that have suggested that they have uh, essentially a placebo effect. And if you do a head-to-head -head comparison with the, uh, the first generation uh, non-steroidals, the first generation non-steroidals have much more uh, efficacy in their performance and in their treatment of uh, osteoarthritis. Still, the anti-inflammatories have side effects, especially gastrointestinal upset. In essence, uh, the recommendations by the American College of Rheumatology for, you know, for these type of diseases is start with Tylenol. Tylenol probably works better on the pain than any of these things. So this latest study leaves patients with not many other alternatives until something new that doesn't have side effects but does work comes along. I'm Dr. Mike Rosen.